Hey, what's going on? So today we got a nice little vintage air conditioner. It's a Fetters. A Fetters Cool Tote. It's the controls. Now I've never had one of these. Um, when I was a kid, I'm pretty old, uh, I remember in the 1970s we had a a General Electric Carry Cool. I remember that, but otherwise, I don't know whatever happened to that one, but I don't have it anymore and haven't haven't had one since. This is similar to that, similar to the Carry Cool. Very slim air conditioner. I, I picked this up off the street. Here's your cool tote badge. It it's got a little it's a little broken spot there. Some of these fins are cracked at the bottom. But not too bad. Oh, this has a chip out of the frame. These are of course all dried out, the inserts. Those are toast. I don't know if this works. I have not turned it on yet. Uh, one of the tabs here is broken. Uh, there's a tab that went in that slot there that's broken off. Got the other one. Uh, there's a little little crack there. This piece here where it screws to the chassis is broken. Other than that, it's not too bad. The directionals both work. Pretty stiff. You got all the dials. There was some decayed foam in here. I threw it out already. Oh, here's the label. It's a 5000 BTU. October 1988. I thought these were older than that, but I guess not. I thought these were from the late 70s, early 80s. I didn't know they made them that late. Uh, anyway, I'm going to have to run the hair dryer to get this thermostat to click. This is the thermostat, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to have to run the hair dryer. It's below 60 today. Alright, I'll come right back. Okay, I think it's clicking. It's kind of hard to tell, but anyway, let's see if it comes on now. It's low fan. Oh. I had it all the way, all the way up. That's why I couldn't hear it clicking. I had the temperature maxed out, I guess. Wow, that, that compressor is super quiet. You can barely hear it. That's incredible. You, you can't even hear it unless you you get right up close to it. Oh, this works. It's cold.
Well, th this definitely works. It's very cold. Wow. It's nice and cold. Yeah, this definitely works. Man, I, I can't believe how quiet that compressor is. Uh, it just shut off. I don't know what kind of compressor it has. In here. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to see it here. Yeah, it, it's in the 50s here today, so it's just not gonna run that long. So yeah, it definitely works. There should got to be some way to, uh, you know, glue another a tab or maybe do some like plastic welding or I don't know. I'm sure that it's got to be fixable. Here's the air exchanger. Oh yeah, that works. I can see it opening. That's it for the compressor. So it's got it's got low and high fan, low, medium, and high cool. Here's medium. There's high. Wow, that's man, it's really got a strong fan. Really strong fan. Wow. That's low again. Yeah, so it's in okay shape. I'm definitely gonna keep this one. I'm glad it works. Made in Korea. So there you go. Uh, this video is probably too long as it is. That's a uh, Fetters Cool Tote. So I will see you next time.